You know, I have two grown sons. And so, you know, I had to uh, see the women they date and all that stuff. And it really changed my uh, view of women. And so now I'm like really protective of guys and the women they get with. Uh, I Mm. don't know. I used to be the other way, but with grown sons, you change a little, you know, you have sons, right? Least. I know exactly what you mean. Yeah, I've got two. And right now I feel like there'll never be anybody good enough for them. No, no one will ever measure up. And you're, you're right. Well, There's no question. I have to say Harry my son, PTSD. my older son, he's got a, a, a wife and they have a baby. And I am so happy with her. I'm telling you what, I'm so oh, happy you're lucky. with her. You know, after I forced my son to divorce his first wife, I had to do a lot of work to get that going. But then I took him to Jerusalem and I said, you better get over to the wall and you better say a prayer that you get a good, you know, one that gets along with me. Get over there and say your prayer right now. So I forced him to go over there and uh, he came back from the wall and I said, did you say your prayer? And he goes, yeah, I prayed that the Broncos would win the uh, Super Bowl there. And I'm like, even God can't make that happen. But anyway, no, they did not win. (laughs) But uh, oh. I said, did you do what I told you and ask for the right woman to come into your life? He goes, yes, I did. Well, we got home. It must not have been more than nine months. Here she comes from Texas, a Jewish girl from Texas. Very nice, very nice family. Thrilled. My granddaughter looks exactly like me, acts exactly like me. It's like mm-hmm. a gift from God. My son says, what kind of karma is it when you're raising your own mother? And I'm like, oh, you so deserve that. (laughs) She's so fun. You're so lucky. It is hard. I think, you know, my guys are still little. They don't date yet. But um, I know I will disapprove of most of the girls they bring home. And I know I will hold my tongue because, you know, don't do that. that. Don't ever. What do you mean? This is my advice. No, don't hold your tongue. Don't ever hold your tongue when it comes to anyone in your family. Because that's just sweeping your crap under the rug. And then you end up with a huge rug in the middle of your house with a lot of shit underneath it that you're living with when you should be sweeping it out the door every day so you can have a clean house with no clutter. You never hold your tongue. Just learn to say things nicely. Mm. Because I'd be worried, I think. You see what I mean? They'd choose her. Like they'd say, you don't like her. I would be worried that they'd say, you don't like her. Bye. We're going to spend all our time together and I'll just exclude you from it and I won't talk to you about it. Well, you can't say I don't like you. Of course. I mean, nobody's going to go for that. You have to say, well, what is it about her that bothers you? And then say like this, you know, it it kind of bothers me when you do this. And I'd really like to resolve that between us so that we can stay close. See, you got a bullshit like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling you in about three to four years, just as soon as my eldest starts dating. We got to resume this. You got to say, uh, you got to say things nicely. That's what I've learned. That's the key. <laughs> well, but don't hold your I mean, tongue. I'll, just say it nice. Some people take CBD for better sleep or less stress and more calm. Some take it for pain relief, for better energy, better focus and concentration. Today, I want to tell you about CB Distillery and their over 2 million satisfied customers. According to a poll of their customers, 90% reported that they sleep better with CBD, 81% said CBD helps with stress, and 80% says CBD helps with aches and pains after physical activity. If you struggle to get a good night's sleep, if you are dealing with too much stress and could use a little calm in your life, if you suffer with pain and discomfort, especially after physical activity or exercise, you could give CBD a try from CB distillery.com. Use my 20% discount by visiting cbdistillery.com and enter my initials MK to get that discount. All right. No prescription required. That's cbdistillery.com. Promo code MK for 20% off cbdistillery.com. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like what you just saw, hit the subscribe button for more clips and full episodes.